Hello everybody, welcome back to Hard Reset Info channel. Today I will show you how to easily fix headphones not detected on Honor 400 Pro. So first, check the headphones. Make sure that the problem is not with headphones themselves. So if you're using those Bluetooth headphones, not the adapter ones, make sure that they are paired and connected properly to your phone. But if you're using the USB-C adapter for your jack, then make sure that the jack is not damaged and the USB adapter is in a good quality because some cheap quality adapters cannot work with some phones. So make sure that you're using either the official one or it's a high quality. Now try inspecting the headphone jack from your USB-C adapter if you have one. So check for debris in the headphone jack. Now if there is something, then use a soft brush or compressed air to clean it. Me personally, I use the second one, so I recommend it. Now you guys can also check for the damage to the port because if the port it may be loose in there and it may be visibly damaged, then it could be the issue. So now after checking it all, check for Bluetooth connections. So let me show you guys. First, let's unlock the phone, go over to the settings and here go to Bluetooth. Now enable the Bluetooth and make sure that your headphones are connected. Now if you're having connection issues, then try unpairing and repairing the Bluetooth device. You can also forget the device and then reconnect it. So as you guys can see, I don't have any devices connected. But if I have one, then basically I'll go here, then click on one and then click on pair. To pair it again, then you need to do it on your own with your headphones and that be it. So now what you guys can do is restart your phone because a simple restart can solve many detection issues caused by software glitches. So hold the power button and the volume up button until you see those two icons pop up. Now click on restart and touch to restart the phone. So now all we have to do is wait so I'll see you guys once the phone is restarted. So after restarting your phone, if the issue is still here, then try testing it with the other headphones. So if possible, then test the device with other headphones, both wired by the adapter and Bluetooth, to check whether the issue is specific to your headphones or the phone's headphone detection. After that, check for software updates, because sometimes audio related bugs are fixed in software updates. So let me show you guys, let me unlock the phone first. Now here enter the settings, scroll all the way down until you guys see system and updates. Here click software update and it will automatically check for you if you run the latest version of the Magic OS. So as you guys can see, for me the software is updated, but if there's an update available for you then download and install it it might fix the detection issues. Now after that what you guys can try and do is going to reset and then clicking reset all settings. Basically no data or documents will be deleted from your device but it will reset a lot of settings like fingerprints, face ID and lock screen password including network settings. So as you guys can see if the reset did not help at all, then what you guys can try is factory resetting your phone as a last resort. Because if none of the above fixes work for you, then you guys can basically try the factory reset. Now I know that this is a last resort, so make sure to back up all your data in the backup and restore in system and updates. So make sure to back up your data here, either by the data backup or the impact rule option. Now here you guys can also enable auto restore. And now go over to reset. Here click reset phone, now click reset phone again, enter your password if you have one. And now click reset or reset and keep ESIMs. 
so if your headphones still aren't detected after all of these steps i showed you guys then the problem could be the hardware of your phone so it's either your adapter the faulty headphone jack it may be the damaged bluetooth module or other internal component so i recommend you guys visiting the service center to get your phone checked or repaired by professionals so that be it, thank you guys for watching, make sure you leave a like, subscribe and a comment if it helps you. So, bye.